Hello and welcome to another edition of Reporter's Notebook where our WNCT reporters share what they've been working on during the day. Today here we have with us Amber Joseph. Amber, welcome. Amber worked on a story today about a longtime barber retiring. It's a very sweet story, so I'm going to let her go ahead and tell us about it. It was a really fun story. Honestly, just going into this barber shop, it's kind of like you go back in time. But I spoke to Pat Moore. He's been cutting hair in Greenville. 50 years. Um, he's cut local businessmen's hair, politicians, the Avet brothers, um, just so many people He's um, have come into his shop. And the story is kind of bittersweet. He's retiring early this year because his wife, Betty Lou, um, has fallen ill. So I kind of talked about his story of his shop and just, you know, the connections and, you know, the impact that he's made on people in Greenville through his shop throughout the years and just what he plans to do with retirement so he'll be retiring he did his last haircut today um and it was really cool to see that and now he'll be going back home and nursing his his wife betty um and just after she's better they're probably going to do some traveling and just have some some good time together at the home so it was really nice to cover it really sweet and um i really had a good day today <laughs> And Amber, is this barber in Pitt County, or where is he located? So um, he is right across from the UVE bookstore in Uptown Greenville. Um, yeah, so he's been there for so long. Everyone knows he's been there for so long. They know that that's, that's his spot. So yeah, um, it's Bar City Barber Shop. So, and even on the door, you can you see a sign that says retired, and if you need anything, just to give him a call. So yeah. And Amber, um, just watching the video, he looks like a very sweet guy. Tell us about his personality. How does he feel about retiring? He was so sweet. He's a jokester. He likes to joke and stuff. Um, and I, I think he's very happy about it. I know, you know, the circumstances with his, his wife being ill are not the best, but he's really optimistic about it, and he's really happy to be um, there for her and help her. Um, and even though he's giving up his passion for cutting hair, you know, he's happy to help the love of his life, you know, get back on her feet. So it was really great to see. Thank you, Amber. And that concludes this edition of Reporter's Notebook. Be sure to tune in tomorrow to the WNCT Now Digital Studio for more news and weather updates. Thanks for watching.